What's up guys, I'm from Esperino and I'm back with another press kit unboxing. Today I have with me the God of War Chain of Olympus uh, press kit for the PSP. This one's a really hard to come by one. It goes back, I think it dates back to 2008. And uh, back in, I think, 2012, I actually did a I did a photo gallery for Esperino and you can actually take a look for yourself. I'll leave a link in the uh, description down below. But I, what I'd do is I thought I'd actually do an unboxing for you guys so you could have a closer look at this uh, kind of a rare piece now. I mean, it goes back to, what, nearly seven years? Yeah, it's been about seven years since this one was actually released, so it's a bit hard to find. But the most distinguishing feature of it is um, this box that it comes in. So the most obvious thing you're going to notice first is that the Omega symbol at the top. Now, if I can just get that, you can see there it's actually a raised Omega symbol. Uh, pattern. It's kind of got like a felt texture to it, which is quite nice. If I can, maybe you can see the detail on it. It's really awesome. Apart from that, the box itself is just fully black. There's really nothing else on it. I mean, on the side there, you can kind of make out like a hinge there, which kind of shows which way it opens. But uh, one of the most common issues this press kit has is actually on the back part here. You can see here, since it's black, it's a bit hard to get into focus, but you can see it's already got kind of like peeling away there. What they did was they actually put like a black adhesive tape there to create a hinge so when you actually open up this press kit it opens up from the bottom section here instead so if I lift this up very carefully you'll see all the contents on the inside now first thing you'll see when you open it up is whoops I'll just take that out so I can give you guys a closer look at this little uh, 3D pop-up art. So you can see there this really awesome 3D pop-up art of uh, Kratos which you can see as you open it up it actually comes alive sort of like very three-dimensional. You got the back of Kratos there and you can see he's kind of looking off and in his back there are a bunch of uh, sort of like undead pursuers which is kind of neat. But I think it's one of the cooler press kits that they've made and it kind of just opens like that and the first thing you'll notice as well is just this Kratos figure which kind of sits at, uh, at the very top there. Now, the thing which I took off, took off the press kit initially is this, uh, I don't know if it's in every single uh, Chain of Olympus press kit, but this is the uh, it's a collector's item. Um, it's actually like a, a mega, I guess you could say it's a neck chain. So. Uh, you can see that it's actually kind of a metal neck chain with the Omega symbol, which um, I think some press kits had it, some press kits didn't. This particular one does have it. And uh, the, one, or the other thing too, which is why the reason the box is so big, is this figure here. Now, you can see there, this is the uh, Nika Toys 20cm um, Kratos with the flaming blades of Athena. So you can see he's got the flaming blades there. You'll probably find a lot of these press kits, um, people didn't generally open these, so I'm not too sure. I don't think this is one is particularly rare, you can probably purchase this through Nika Toys. I mean, it's probably discontinued now, but you should be able to find uh, quite a few of these from uh, God of War fans, you know, sealed and intact. But this particular one hasn't been opened, and uh, I plan on keeping it that way actually, because there's really no need to open that one at the moment. Underneath everything, you can see... There's a UMD as well as an SD card. Now, if you're wondering about the SD card, this SD card is, uh, it actually contains the assets. Now, this was actually a bonus from the cell that I, I got this from. He's actually loaded onto an SD card of all the assets because um, he wanted a backup of it. Um, so he sent that along uh, with the press kit all those years ago. <laughs> so I've kept that one. And underneath that, you get a copy of God of War Chains of Olympus on UMD. Now this is the uh, retail release, I believe. Yeah, this is the retail version, so that's the full version of the game. And on the top section is this uh, God of War Chains of Olympus press disc. Now, a lot of the press discs, sorry, press kits that I've seen for Chains of Olympus is you're generally missing this disc. I don't know why that's the case. Um, I've probably seen like, now, I've actually had two of these in the past, and uh, both of them didn't have the press disc included. So when I actually managed to get one of these, this was uh, 
It was quite a hard find. So if you are looking for a God of War Chain of Olympus press kit, make sure you look out for this in particular, because I don't know why they're missing, but they tend to always be missing from this particular press kit. And that's pretty much all there is to it, really. If you take out the um, cardboard underlay, which I've taken off many times, there's, act there's actually nothing in there. It's just uh, cardboard just to hold the press disc and the UMD. And uh, yeah, it's not the most complicated press kit, but the, the way that it's been displayed is really nice. And uh, it's definitely one of my... Um, favorite press kits, which is why I've kept it for all these years, just for this little Kratos 3D pop-up art. So uh, that's a quick look at the God of War Chains of Olympus press kit. So keep in mind that if you are looking for one of these, make sure you look out for the press disc and also make sure that this hinge there, I mean it's really going to be hard to find it in perfect condition, but at least try to find it in mostly intact so you can at least repair it on your own if you need to. Thanks as always for watching, if you've enjoyed this quick press kit unboxing please leave a thumbs up and uh, don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to keep up to date with all our latest videos as they go live. Until next time take care and I'll catch you later, bye!